Okay, Everett. Everett. Everett, which doesn't exist. That name does not exist anywhere. Anybody can do a background check on that name across the world. Everett Scott does not exist. Trust me, I know how to dox people. I've looked this fucking name up back and forth across the years. That name does not exist. If anybody can, can come up with that name, let me know. Nobody has ever seen Everett Scott. Nobody has ever heard that voice, ever. Because that's Megan Ferguson. The only reason Everett ex Scott exists on this YouTube platform is to comment about me or my son's case. Everybody knows that. If you do a video about Brian St. John and tag it in there, that bitch will show up. So will Sundancer. That's the only reason they're here. Everybody that knows me and has followed me on YouTube for all these years knows that the only reason that bitch exists is because of me and this case. No content, no comments ever, always where they're talking about Brian. That one will show up. Now listen, I'm going to read this one out because this is how these Fergusons think. This is a Ferguson, trust me. Jesus Christ, your desperation is real. I have not said one word about you, fucking liar. I see you over in the chat talking about me, and then I post about you. What you're saying is, what you keep saying is, you, this is you not saying one word. Well, if I post that trial, it'll blow the whole thing open. You don't have the trial, bitch. You don't have it. You're never going to post it. You're never. Your excuse is that the trial shows the, the, uh, the injuries to Braden. Well, when I put it up, I just cut that part out. There's only a little bit of parts where they're showing pictures and everything. I cut that part out, and I uploaded it into an unlisted video and told people if they wanted to see that part, then I would send it to them. And there were some people that wanted to see it, and I sent it. Everett Scott is only here to fuck with me. And yes, you do have me blocked, she says, while she's commenting on my community post. If you have someone blocked, they can't comment on your community post. Let's see. That means, look, look, check this out. You want to talk about desperate and thirsty? I have this motherfucker blocked, right? This motherfucker creates another profile just to talk to me. But, but but I'm desperate and thirsty, right? This is desperate and thirsty right here. Let's go back here. Let's go back to the comment. And yes, you do have me blocked. I only saw your ridiculous thirsty behavior because it was sent to me. All you got to do is tell people to quit sending you shit. That's what I did. I told people a long time ago, don't be sending me shit when somebody talk about me. If I, if I see it, I see it. If not, blah, blah, blah. You've been going on and on and on, on and on about me for three days. You go on about me every time you post. Every time you're in a chat. You don't talk about current events. You don't talk about drama somewhere else. You only talk about me, you fucking idiot. And I totally ignored you. You haven't ignored me. You've been in the chats. I can see you talking shit about me, you fucking retard. Also, go right ahead and think what you want, but you're the only one who constantly brings up your son. No, other people saw you guys bringing up my son. That's the only fucking reason you're here. Have you ever discussed anything else on YouTube but me and my son? No, you haven't. Never. Ever. I don't care if people comment about my son. I didn't do that shit. I don't bring it up for attention, you fucking idiot. I bring it up because you people are talking about me. As if I had something to do with that shit. As if I called Luke up that day and said, hey, you need to do this. You fucking idiots. Why don't you follow Kelsey around, you fucking fat bitch? She got away with it. Michelle Muti didn't get away with it. When she allowed some man in her house where they had a court order with CPS to keep him away and he killed one of her kids, she went to prison for 12 years for violating the order. Go ride, go ride Kelsey's fucking ass, you dumb bitch. You don't live far from her. Listen to this. Listen to this. Also, go right ahead and think what you want, but you're the only one that constantly brings up your son. You bring up the fact that blah, blah, blah. Trust
trust and believe I do have the entire trial up. Well, where's that? There's no point. You think there's no point in putting a trial out that 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 you can remember a child who passed away? You think there's no point in that? There's no way I can lie if you have it in the video. If you have something in a video, there's no way I can lie about it. You do not have the trial. I am the one who went down and got the trial on disc and posted it. I'm the only one who's ever posted a trial. It's never been aired on TV. I went and got it, you fucking fat bitch. Because, the light truth, me and Tracy, I went and got the trial, the discovery, the police reports, everything. And it was all posted, you fucking dumb bitch. You don't have it. You do not have the trial. You will never post a trial. I tell you what. Post a clip that wasn't on the news. Just a, just a small clip. Matter of fact, if you have the entire trial and you want me to shut up about you having the trial, just post the entire part where Dustin Middleton was on the stand. You want to shut me up? You're never going to post it. And if you do, it's only because it's a video that I went and already posted. People know that I posted it, you fucking retard. I posted the whole trial, you fucking idiot. Even parts where Kelsey got up on the stand and lied. You fucking idiot. Hey, Wendy B, don't, don't you ask Poofy Pants here why he is following me around. I ain't following you around, you dumb bitch. When I see somebody in the, it, it, that puts up a fucking video that has my name in it, your fucking fat ass is always there. You need to be going to take care of your husband that molested your kids. Alexandro. Alexandro. Your husband, the one that molested your kids. That's what you need to be going to take care of. You know, the one that you said was coming to kick my ass two years ago. He never showed up. That one. Follow you around. This is what he does. He starts drama behind the scenes, then he acts like he's a victim. He tried picking a fight with Jay. You notice how J.J. J. J. Hondo and Vinny don't fuck with me no more? You notice that? Once we dug into Hondo's past, found out that he harbored a sex offender and protected his sex offender brother. You notice they don't fuck with me no more? And Vinny, who gets drunk, pissed on the floor. I didn't start with JJ, JJ, man. I didn't start with Vinny either. Vinny was running on, going on about Molly, and I said something about Molly, then he went on about my son, because he's a fucking retard like you. That's all you people got is something that somebody else did. My son did that. So what? So that that's what that's what you got? He did it, not me. Oh, I also started with Carla. Fuck Carla. And fuck Vinny. And fuck Arno. And fuck Vinny. Didn't it? Fuck Carla. And her surgeries. I can care less. I care as much about her as she did about me. I could give a fuck less about her. Who gives a fuck about her major surgery? You always start on this freak, you fucking idiot. You always, that's the only reason you're here, you fucking fat bitch. And you know how many times I've heard this one? This is the last bit of attention you're going to get from me, sweaty. You're a non-fucking factor. Let me see, this non-factor just got you to create a new free profile and give me two paragraphs of your time, this non-factor. Fuck fat-ass bitch. Fuck Daryl. 